okay I have to be back again right now right here I just want to emphasize that after three days of human dissonance report had been blacked out now it come back again you can see that right here it's about 2.6 kilo megahertz the maximum one and the lowest one about 1.3 megahertz please be demand again that this is a earth heartbeat if you look this graph at the ER or ICU the doctor will tell you that you are in critical condition your heart really value and should be stopped pretty soon this is how earth heartbeat is in critical take a look at the when alarm bell you can see that the when alarm bell also drop close to the satellite orbit so many times not good at all if you look at the solar wind speed that we detect from the spacecraft on around the world it's not over 500 km per second it's not really high it's not really but because of when the land bell drop close to the earth so many energy especially the radiations from different rays pour down to the earth and it affects our DNA and chromosome even plant and animal and most of the energy if we look at the graph it's not coming from the front not from our sun from other sun other suns this one including the solar system that orbit move to in our solar system the small one and someone said that dark matter or the brow dark and another form other solar system from tranquilum and what is that sometimes somehow I forgot what I have to say anyway NASA may say that one come from the galactic sheet so it come from outside our solar system both outside and inside they are really damaged our when alarm bell and make our earth magnetic feel pretty weak not good at all and sometimes somehow earth have no magnetic at all take a close look to the different uh, measurement and again you can see that the earth magnetic at the north pole had been split into four and six from time to time and from time to time again it split into eight it's not good at all our time has been limited we are really close or approach to the to the pole ship the north pole doesn't have to move to 40 degree mark the pole ship could happen at any time as i tell you at any time but during uh, not during uh, okay during last June to the November right as I ask my as I have my data and I have to make the calculation it should be happen about June it's coming June in about six months but again before that happened the worst case scenario of many many phenomena or the weather or climate it will affect our life as you know that you have the cyclone bomb in California 
how could have the the storm and flooding in California at winter? Many things we are. Even yesterday in my country, in myself, with a strong wind that happened totally. So the energy from the sun, from our sun and other suns. Take a look at this one, the sunspot 3163 that rotated back and renamed as uh, 3182 had at least Ekfair and Mfair today. This transport will remain about at least 25 days before it rotates to the back. So during these 25 days, we expect more M-class and A-class. But it our luck uh, in this location the solar storm or the CME will go to another way, not directly hit Earth. But because of the sun rotate, something like this, right? And in the, the cycle, some of this CME will affect or will be hit Earth with the uh, small damage. But the radiation itself already hit Earth. Don't forget that about the very fast, very fast lighting, very fast radiation that come to hit us suddenly. It it looks the same as you uh, stand beside the road and the big truck just passed away the road. And look at the effect from the wind, right? Wind tail from the big truck, something like that. Even the big bike, something like that. The same thing happened with Earth now. That's why the spacecraft checking and the Earth had been checking too. Anything that hit Earth make us uncomfortable and make Earth more wobble. And the water on around the world had been what did it, transformed from one location to another location. So you have to expect about the strong wave on each shore, especially on the west side. I say for for the west side because of the earth rotation, right? So the water from here will go to hit this area. So the west side of the, of any other location will be hit by the uh, strong wave because of the water move let's say from west to east but this area in the west side right so should be hit the same as in uh, Africa and Europe okay from Sweden Finland United Kingdom uh, go to Jiponta and to Africa this area will be hit by the big wave the same as in Indian and Andaman so the people who live by the seashore have to make the plan for evacuation whenever your government has announced what will happen. Expect more radiation, expect more the phenomena, expect more the, the create an extreme climate change, extreme weather change. Both climate and weather will be not the same. Don't talking about the El Nino and Janina. It's not the same. Any country around the world may have three seasons or four seasons in one day. In which four hours, some area maybe have four seasons in 12 hours. You have to expect more and more worst case scenario. Keep care yourself and take good care of yourself and your family. Don't forget that. Try your best to make the underground shelter as much as you can. 
and you have to prepare your spirit right to calm down and you may have to try to practice the meditation we have to prepare not only physical but we have to prepare our spiritual to face the huge event don't forget that NASA has been stated that three fourths of the population will be gone. About 500 million people will be survived. 500 million people from 8,000 million people. If you prepare yourself, I believe you will be one in 500 million people. Don't expect anything. Try your best. If you have the heart disease or in the brain or something about your blood pressure, try to find a herb to cure yourself. Avoid the chemical medicine. It's not good for your body. Yeah. Eat the food as medicine, not eat medicine at the food. Another big movement should be after January 21st. can see this one will rotate again from time to time we form the from the five and from the fifth on the sixth and on the seventh so this one will produce more and more solar fair and when it moves to about this area it will be earth free direction and I shall go out and take a photo of the sunspot again to make the comparison between yesterday and today. God bless you all.